Oh, sorry, didn't see you there, I was just lifting some weights. Howdy y'all, Bush51 doing Let's Play Pokemon Trading Guard Game Part 28. Alright, in the last part, we finished off beating these guys. Attention card players! No. Anyway, in this part, we are going to be taking on the next club master by the name of Mitch. Basically, he's um pretty much what we've been seeing these past few videos. He's got a bunch of fighting type Pokemon. Except, uh, he's got a bunch of fighting Pokemon that can pretty much start hitting you hard right off the bat, like Hitmonchan and Machop and stuff like that. So, accordingly, I modified my deck to Head in the Clouds Plus deck, because it used to be Head in the Clouds, now there's more in it. Um, Average Cadavers, uh, Firo, same deal, basically, blah blah blah, nothing special really. Alright, so let's get right into it! So, you have defeated all of my pupils! Let's see if you have what it takes to inherit the legendary Pokemon cards! Okay, are you ready? Do you like Duel Mitch? Yes, I shall. Come on, show me what you've got. We'll play a plat. <laughs> we'll play with six prizes. Fighting Club Master Mitch, first strike deck. Oh man, I'm excited. Hey, we get to hear the Ebbings again. Awesome. All right, let's see what we got here. We got a Spiro and a Firo to start off the battle, and a Bill. Not bad. Except I would like to have basic Pokemon. <laughs> I wonder if I could just take out his entire team with Firo. That'd be awesome, but very much wishing. All right, coin toss. Oh, darn it! Tails again. Oh well, no big deal. Cause that matchup can't do anything to me right now anyway. Since I resist fighting, ha nya nya nya. Oh, I got a Ghastly who also resists fighting. That's awesome. Hey, so let's use this Bill. I have to put in Ghastly down on the bench. You get a switch and a gust of wind. That those two cards can potentially help us later on in the game. Um, let's do let's power up Spiro first because obviously Spiro is going to be in need of power ups to become Firo. All right, so we're gonna pick it. We're gonna pick him right in the chest, right in the stomach, right in his guts. Unfortunately, it doesn't have guts like he would in the fourth gen. Ugh, that'd be scary. Okay, so I guess he's got a hit on Lee on the bench too. Hmm. Ooh, hey, I got Haunter. Uh, might as well evolve him now, I guess, just to get that out of the way. Uh, put the Psychic Energy down onto Spiro, and we're not going to evolve him yet, because he can't do anything if he evolves. So you can check and see, okay, he's got a Machop a Hitmon and two Hitmonlee, and one of them has a Fighting Energy. Okay, so let's do this then. Let's use his Energy Removal on Hitmonlee, because he's much more of a threat than that Machop is right now. Then let's attack with Peck again because that's really all I can do. Excellent! Lovely. Oh, also, why he's taking his turn? Um, I. Oh, okay, he's gonna do great. Just completely obliterate what I did for the last two turns. Anyway, um. Guys, I wanna get your opinion. What do you think about the update schedule? Because so far, or, well, not so far, but recently, it's been more spontaneous than anything. And I don't know if you guys want it to be that way still, or if you guys want more of a concrete, like, update schedule, I don't know. You guys tell me, I would like to know. Anyway. Alright, so we're gonna evolve him into Firo now, now that he can use agility. And we're gonna throw down this plus power... Actually, no, we're not. Um... Actually, yeah, we're gonna throw down plus power just in case if I don't get an energy next turn. Then we're gonna use agility! So we'll be able to kill him in two turns, and be protected for the next turn. Awesome. I get the box of safety! Awesome. I love the box of safety. Okay, so now it's my turn again, since he can't do anything. Okay, I got another Fero. That's not really helpful, but... Alright, let's see... Is that, uh... Yeah, they hit him only as stretch kick. That's not good. Um, hmm. Let's just get rid of it with agility, I guess. There's not really much else we can do. <laughs> heads, 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 yes! I'm getting heads this time, hoo <laughs> And another box of impunity! I I'm just gonna keep calling it different names every time. See if I can run out. Ooh, I got another plus power, awesome. That's helpful, that's quite helpful. Alright, now I guess he's gonna try... Oh, or he's gonna try attack on a turn. You are a jerk! Mitch, you are the jerk of jerks. All right, I got Abra. Probably not a good idea to put him on the bench because he'll just die in two turns. But um, let's see what's he got in this play area anyway? He's got a Machop and another Hitmonlee. So actually, what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna gust of wind to his um 
Yeah, and then use Gust of Wind on his Machop to get his Machop out there, since it's way more vulnerable than his Hitmonlee. Then we use Plus Power again, and I'm gonna use Agility again to see if I can protect myself from damage yet again. But I can't. But it doesn't matter. Oh well. Now that Machop's gonna die. Haha. Uh -huh. Okay, just another. I guess he's probably gonna power up his other Hitmonlee now. Which would be more of a pain, except for the fact that, well, <laughs> it doesn't really matter. Alright, um, double colorless energy, hmm. I guess we can put that on, <laughs> this is gonna look ridiculous, but we can put it on Firo, now it has 5 energy. I don't even think anything could cost 5 energy way back then, but just in case if for some odd reason I get, um, energy removal. So now, let's go for agility and try and see if we can get another box of immunity. There we go. <laughs> and if someone can keep a running tab of the different names I add for the agility, like, safety mechanism, then please feel free. Okay, great, I got another double colorless energy, awesome. Okay, so now he's gonna send out another one of his Hitmonlee, or the Hitmonlee we already saw. Oh, Mankey is slightly kind of obnoxious, because um, basically what happens is it just lets you look either at the top card of my deck or his deck, or a random card from my hand. Which, whatever. <laughs> Not that big a deal. Oh no, we kicked Haunter again! Ah, uh, why? Why you do that? Why? Okay, so we got a Psychic Energy. Um... We're gonna hold on to that, actually. And what we're gonna do is, we're gonna attack with Dropek. Um... Yeah, I guess... Attack with Dropek. Because, I don't know, there's not really much else we can do. Haunter's probably gonna die, unfortunately, but what can you do? <laughs> there will be no chance of Gengar. Oh, okay, and he's gonna draw cards. Cheater! Cheater! Augusta of what? No! No! Why? Why? Why would you do that? What do you- Ah, uh, no! Okay, that was- I don't know, that seemed really pointless to me, because he could've just stretch kicked it. But whatever. Okay. Anyway, now that Firo is back out, <laughs> that was kind of pointless. All right, let's see, we got another Psychic Energy. Not really much we can do right now, because I don't want... I'm gonna check the bench and see... Maggie. Okay, and his Hitmonlee is getting powered up, so there's not really much point in putting anything down. So, I'm just gonna attack with Agility and hope for the best. Try and get another Heads. Heads! Yes! Awesome! Spectacular. <clears throat> Box of Immortality. All right. Oh, nice! We got an Injury removal. That's actually gonna help. Well, I mean, it will help eventually, but... Now all he can really do is... Oh, what's he doing? Oh, he's gonna look at the top card of my deck. Okay. Okay, and for some odd reason, he's not even attacking me? Really? Oh, no, because I had agility. Duh. I was gonna say, what the heck. Um... Let's hold on to this energy... Yeah, let's hold on to that energy. Let's use Drill Pack. Try and get this Hitmonlee out of here. Because <laughs> Firo is all I got right now. I haven't even used, like, Mewtwo or Cadabras or anything right now. I'm just beating him to death with a giant bird. I can just almost picture Firo, like, flailing violently, and he's doing better than... I don't know. Okay, I got another Ghastly. Um... I'm gonna hold on to him, I guess, since he's not really gonna help much, since I only have one Haunter in the deck, so... Let's use... Um... Let's go with Agility again, see if I can protect myself one more time. Ah, nope. Oh well. I don't even think it would've mattered, because all he has left is that Mankey that does, like, 10 damage. Which is no big deal. And there's Mewtwo! What do you know, hey? Now I can put him down on the bench without fear of him, you know, dying. Except I think this match is... mine. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Looks like I won. Mitch was disappointing. Alright, so let's just put Mewtwo down just in case, and then add a psychic energy to him. Okay. Firo! Drill Pack! Overkill! 40 HP, 230 HP Pokemon. I got a switch. There are no Pokemon Mitch's display area! Decision! I won the duel with Mitch! Once again, it was a d disappointing duel, but whatever. I'll take it. Wonderful! Great match! You're very good! Here, take this! It's the Fighting Medal! You'll find the secret to the decks of the club encrypted in it! Bushy won the Fighting Medal! That's six medals, guys! We got two more to go! Here, take this too! It's a Laboratory Booster Pack! Which seems rather odd, considering... they're like the opposite of a laboratory. Whatever. Ninetales, Ghastly, Weezing, Tentacruel! 
Recycle Spiro Magnemite Onyx Gambler Slowpoke. And another laboratory boost pack. Let's see what we got in this one. We got Ooh, Polyrath, that's pretty cool. Marowak, Pokedex, Porygon, Grimer, Magnemite, Recycle, Slowpoke, Horsey, Duo Duo. I hope to duel someone like you again someday! Me too, there guy, except you were kinda easy, so it doesn't matter. Alright, so it looks like we're actually gonna end this part off here, guys. Alright, in the next part, we actually have a bit of a surprise, and it's actually gonna take a little while. <laughs> as soon as I ask that, or answer that question, rather, I don't really know. Hmm. Actually, I might. Because the next part is going to be the challenge hall once again, but I might actually record it and then post it later. I don't know. I might do something like that. Who knows? But, um, yeah. So there you go. Alright, so, in this part, we got the 6th medal, the Fighting Club medal. In the next part, we are actually either going to be going to the Challenge Hall, or we are going to be heading over to the Psychic Club. Which is probably one of the most boring of the clubs. But, anyway, alright! <laughs> Thanks again for watching, guys. Till next time, Bushy51, peace out!